Hello guys, so yes, I went out and tried the Anastasia Beverly Hills Beauty Balm. I put some of my skincare for the morning, which is just the retinol and the Neostrata serum. Then I put some of the sunscreen for ABIB and some of the primer for from NYX and I waited until that dried out a bit then I went to do my eyebrows I use eyeshadows for my eyebrows um, I personally like how the color is and everything comes out so that's what I use for my eyebrows while that dried off the sunscreen and all that I went and used the, the main product it came in a little bar I put it on I think it was a little bit too light for my skin but after blending it, it kind of melted in my face and didn't look too weird it does look more like concealer if I get like a concealer this is the color I would get as you can see it's kind of everywhere but I just had to blend it out it was very dewy so if you don't like dewy you might not like this um, then I set it with the all nighter setting spray it kind of worked. Uh, it didn't come out as much as usual foundations do, and I liked it because it wasn't too no. itchy. Even if I did scratch, it did come out. That's the only negative thing I will say about. But it kind of just melts in your face. It's very sheer, so if you don't like sheer makeup, keep that in mind. Um, the other YouTubers are not to use powder, but I didn't see anything with the powder blush so it could be just that um i use a cream stick a creamy liquid uh contouring and yeah i like how it kind of work together and yeah i just blended it all i did my eyes and all that i was out from one till like six that's when we come we came back home and it kind of went out. Uh, if you want to see what products I use, I will put them below if you want them. If not, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> um, that's only if you want to see what I use. But yeah, uh, most of it I get it from Marshalls or something. Something like that. Because, yeah, I don't like to waste a lot of money on stuff my brush was wet so I had a had to use a different brush and so put that which uh, wasn't bad this is the whole powder blush I had and I think it came out pretty well I will say it did crease a lot around my mouth area so I had to blend it a lot more which I'm kind of like it is what it is because I think most foundations do that to me and I don't know how to make it not do that um, but I do like how it looks especially on how it feels when it goes on your face it is a little bit thick in the beginning but once you blend it out I think it looks good and this was me in the sun it, it was a really bright day this is when I came home and as you can see nothing is coming off so I'm assuming it kind of melted in my face